Hi everyone, it's Gail and it's Mixed Media Monday. I am going to work today on doing some of these fun um, beeswax papers. I'm, I'm getting low on what I have, so I'm excited to do that. So that's what we're gonna play with today. I have some different papers. I have um, some digitals that I wanted to do. So that's what we're gonna do. So let's see, let's say hi and hugs to Lynn Debbie, Melly, and Carol. Thank you so much for watching and your kind comments. Okay, let's play. Um, I still have some of these soy beads. They're like candle bead things. Hot apple cider, this one. But I ordered this on Amazon, Yellow Beeswax. Beesworks, it's called. And I think it's going to be great as well see the little the little beads so i think that'll be fun too okay so let's get busy um i guess i could show you i thought i'd try it on one of my eco dyed prints i just printed a bunch of my digitals thinking that that would be fun this is a french document maybe vintage Vintage ephemera, vintage envelopes, Italian receipts, maybe it's called something like that. Um, and then, and then my speckle papers, because I've used all of that. That all is all that all is gone. So I grabbed those two, and I just cut, put them on plain old copy paper, is what I did. So I'm gonna put I'm gonna put this one down. Um, gotta remember kind of how I did this, and I'm gonna sprinkle some wax on it. I kind of want a couple of the. I'm gonna sparingly use these because oh whoops well there we go. Um, because they smell so good and it makes the paper smell good, which then in turn makes your journal smell good. So, so I do have to tell you too, the carpenters have been about today. So, um, just FYI, if you hear a lot of clanging and banging, that's them. This is Roxy Creations. I put it on, um, coffee dyed paper. Let's put it on top and then just kind of see what happens. I honestly, oh, I think I have, did I have one under too? I think I did. I don't remember. I don't remember how I did it before, but might as well make use of as much of the wax as we can, is what I'm thinking. So, so, I hope you're all having a good day. Yeah, I wanted to tell you that the carpenters were here. My um, my friend that cleans my house is here. She's so sweet. She always says, your house is always clean. <laughs> and I said, it's because you're here. That's why. It's not nothing I do. <laughs> Uh, I did have to, I ran around like a chicken with my head cut off this morning because I had to switch out bedding. So, um, as you know, my son was here and his daughter last weekend, and then my daughter and her family are coming this next weekend. So, I'm trying to spread it out a little bit. I'd like to get most of the sheet is what I'm kind of hoping for so so yeah um we've got another volleyball tournament this weekend cited for that it's been a long time since I got to watch Addie and Katie play volleyball so it'll be fun okay might need a little more of the beads I just might Oh, it's pretty. It's pretty gloppy. Let's see if I can smooth that out to the edge a little bit. So 
So my husband, or my husband, my son made it home a okay. I was worried because the it was snowy, and I was worried it was going to be icy. Oh, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Oh, I hope I'm not jiggling the camera too much, guys. That's kind of part of the deal, though. Oops. Yeah, three pages is a good idea because, yeah, look at that. That's cool. That's really cool. Okay, um, let's put a few more down here. And I could put like a little piece of paper. This is super thin, but hopefully it will be okay. I thought it would be fun to have it, have it wax though. Ah. The bumpy little, bumpy little bits of wax are not happy underneath there. So Mike and I have been watching at night. We've been watching uh, the Hunger Games series of movies. We watched them when they came out. We had read the books. It's a weird concept, a very weird concept. But I don't know. I just think Jennifer Lawrence does an amazing job. Oh, that's sticking. Oh, that's kind of cool. I'm not going to worry about getting necessarily to the edges, I don't think. Oh, there's a little bit right there that I can pick up. Maybe. <laughs> totally not an expert at doing this, guys, but I enjoy the results, so I just kind of go for it. Yeah. So... That's what we've been doing at night, although we watched a scary movie with my son and we watched basketball, but then, ooh, yeah, that is really cool. It's super thin. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to use that for, but it will find, it will find a purpose. This one's pretty good. Yeah. That's good. Okay. And this one is pretty good. And on the bottom, let's put something else on the bottom. And I think I'll put this on the top, maybe. What do I want to do? Actually, I want something else on the bottom. We'll put we'll put these on the top, I think on top of it. Okay. Bees wax beads. Try and keep them from going everywhere. Um, yeah, so that's what was it. My son's a huge Laker fan. Loves the Lakers. Has been since he was a kid. So, so yeah, we watched, watched a little of the Lake show, as he would say. And, uh, was fun yesterday uh they had some oh they had a board meeting for their board before they had to go um go testify or whatever in front of the legislature and so it was fun um his boss came over <laughs> And they worked for, on our dining room table. <laughs> it was really kind of fun. They came in, and I, I know his, his, his boss, the director of the Montana Digital Academy, was a teacher at the high school. And um, so I knew him, kind of knew him from that, but... Um, 
just over the years of my son working with him and stuff, gotten to know him, a super nice guy, uh, likes to have a laugh. So when, when he came in, I said, whoa, it's been a lot of years since Mikey had a, a buddy over to play. <laughs> he laughed. He said, yeah, that's what we do. We play. I said, well, that's the best way if you can play while you're working. <laughs> it's funny. Okay, I was just trying to get a little more on the edges of this. But... Actually, that looks pretty good, except for right there. I've got my um, my irons plugged in kind of on the wrong side of me to make this work like I'd like to, but that's cool. They just feel so cool. I wish you guys could feel them. I'm just going to do these two and try and get that spread out some to the edges of the papers and just even like these these receipts even just um, put into a pocket in your journal it's cool and then it, it's a cool texture and it just smells good oh still got some good beads there let's see what could I do I guess I just smash them down get them all I feel like I have a lot of wax <laughs> for these ones ew but it's cool huh I hope you can see I don't know how well this turns out on camera but it sure is fun guys I just thought I'd try a book page. I'll try and pick up some of that wax with this. And like, you know, you can remelt it too. You can go back over and remelt and that works too. Try it right here. So I'm doing bedding laundry while my friend is doing the cleaning cleaning. Mike's walking on the treadmill. I think the carpenters left. I think they probably have to pick something up at Home Depot or something. But they're kind of getting there on it. Ah, that was hot. Slowly but surely. Ooh, that's cool. That's real cool. Okay. figure out some place to lay it down. I think this one I'm going to call done. Ooh, that is cool. I thought that eco print would be really cool. And I do. I like it. Okay, so I'm trying not to set these on top of each other until they're dry because um, you know, it's a bit it's a bit, I don't know what to say. You know what? I'm going to see if I can melt some of this wax that I've got on this um, cardboard on here. Pick some of that up. Got a big drippy spot right here. I just keep these um, cardboards from time to time too, and then I just have them when I when I want to do this. Okay. So I don't know how exciting this is for you guys to watch, but I'm having fun. <laughs> I like this bagel, bagel beeswax. It's easy to use, just pulling it out like this is easy. So um, 
So yeah, well, and I do appreciate if you go through my favorite things to grab it. I don't have a specific item for it, but um, you could go through, if you go through my search, I still get a little something at no extra cost to you. Um, yeah, so I appreciate you doing your Amazon shopping through my website that through my favorite things. Yeah. A lot of you do. And I thank you so much. Kind of an easy way to support without, um, you know, an easy way to support with, I'm going to do this one. No, I wonder if I can do one of these old book pages too. This one's ripped already, but let's just see what, see what we get. Um, yeah. So anyway, this, I, I was wondering how this would be and it's really good. It's really good. My heater turned on and I've got a piece of acetate in a basket over there that's kind of flapping in the wind and I'm like, what is that? <laughs> yeah, I was excited to do this. I just wanted to have more to more to work with. I just have I have a little pile over here, but I'll show you that some of those uh, give you an idea of other things that you can use to do this. This is better too because the um, Amazon beeswax isn't scented and um, using just the scented, it was a bit much. It was like, whew, but um, now I can just Sprinkle a little bit, and that's helpful. Okay, let's take you off of there. If we can get you. Try to do it without ripping it. Ooh, isn't that cool? Ooh, that's beautiful. Okay. Um, we'll just smooth this out on the, on the whole of the papers here. See if we can... So, not sure what my next project's going to be. I have committed yet again because I am so silly and can't say no. <laughs> but I've committed to um, to doing. I'm going to put this is really really wet, so I'm going to put another piece on there and try and soak some of that up. Um, a, to do a collaboration thing in April, so that's good, but um, yeah, I think I'm going to try. Yesterday, I had, I didn't do any filming yesterday um, with my son and his boss here. I didn't know, he. they would have been right above me in our dining room, and I didn't know if my talking would have been disruptive so I didn't do any videos yesterday and then um, gosh I did I picked up all of that uh, so I did finish some unfinished things oh that's pretty okay I'll set you there this one is really cool too Ooh, really cool. Okay, where can I set you? Are you dry? You're pretty dry. I'll set it right there. Okay, I'm going to see what I can pick up with this parchment paper. It's really cool with the beeswax on it. I'm just going to kind of go slow and see if I can melt what's underneath into it. Um, 
yeah, so anyway, what did I get done? Um, do you remember when I did the two? Oh, I can show you. Right here. Ugh. Remember these two covers that I did out of uh, jelly print on craft card stock? So I finished those up. I sewed around them. I put on corners. I put their little... Um, holes in there and I think those will be awesome for fall journals when the time comes you know so did that what else did I do oh from the die cutting session we had I stamped my Tim Holtz tickets um, did that. sewed around a couple journal cards oh and then I I got my um, correspondence journal, all the sewing done in that too. So it was kind of good to have a non-filming day because I got some, got some things done, which was good. Okay. That's, that's pretty good. Got a lot up off that. Okay. Set that there. Set that over there. It's pretty quick to do this, really. I'm thinking, hmm, what else are we going to do? I know what I could do. I know what. There's always something, right? Um, and yeah, we're, we're getting there. Let's do, let's do this one. And then we'll... Yeah, and then, you know, kind of once you have a stash of these, you can just keep using them and stuff. It's just like anything else, like, you know, jelly prints or any other arty things that you do to put in your journals. You make a bunch of them, and then you're set. Okay, so let's do just a few of the smelly ones. I'm reminding myself of the Friends episode where Phoebe is singing smelly cats, smelly cats. Okay, so there's that. And let's do this one. It's kind of cool. It's got, you can see that writing on the background from the other side too. It's kind of cool. Okay. And... We'll, we'll start with this one on the top. Yeah, so I, yeah, I think I have something over there. I can kind of show you some other mixed media projects that I have that I want to do. You know, there's just not enough time in the day, is there? Somebody asked me recently, how do you come up with all the ideas for your <laughs> for for your daily videos? And I'm like, gosh, I can't get everything done I want to even. So I have more ideas than I have days, that's for sure. And you know, each project takes time too. Got, oh, it sounds like our carpenters are back. So if you hear some drilling or anything like that, they're redoing the post that was put in incorrectly and it's right up against that wall. So you might hear them. Okay, let's try and take that little guy off of there. Ooh, he's cool cool yeah that's really cool okay that's going there okay should I put another thing maybe oh let's put these envelopes out. okay now we can now we cannot be so gentle <laughs>
gosh, I do find this fun because it's qu pretty quick. So it's like you get a lot of results fairly, fairly quickly, which not everything you do is that has that immediate gratification, you know, instant gratification. That's what we'll call it. Yeah, I've been watching a few videos on YouTube about estate sales and stuff. I've been avoiding them because I have a pile of stuff that I need to take or, you know, I need to put on my Etsy. And so I've kind of been avoiding them because I can't seem to get the stuff on that I already have. But I love going to them. And I didn't at all. Well, it's been several years because um, I didn't go at all during the you-know-what. Ow, that's hot. <laughs> okay. Try not to do this. Try not to burn myself. But, ooh, that's really cool. Okay. Oh, cool. Cool. All right, so in this one, looks like it's pretty well covered. I feel like I need to pick some of that up. Let's use another one of these receipts. See what all we can, look at that. Yeah, there's a lot there to pick up. And now I have a lot more on my, on my board too, although, you know, it just dries and it'll melt when you when you do your project again, so. Oh, that's working good. The round motion is working well. Scooching it to the edges. would be so much easier if my if I had my my iron plugged on my right side instead of my left I keep kind of running into it but that's where my plug-in is so what are you gonna do okay so there we go there that one Ooh, love that hot 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 I don't know when I'm gonna realize that that's the case Let's see, these are probably cool. Okay, we'll uh, also look look at what all we've done too. Okay, these are, well, I might could pick up a little bit more, so I'm gonna try to. Yeah. It's funny, it's sometimes hard to kinda get it going as far as the wax melting, but then once you do, man, yeah, kind of end up with more than you bargained for. So, <laughs> that carpenter wanted to use the restroom and Mike had to take his shoes off, <laughs> which was good. Sometimes they don't, and it's like, oh, our floors just get crunchy. But I can appreciate that they need a pit stop every now and again. Mike said, it's up to you. You can go into the trees, or you can <laughs> come in the house. <laughs> oh. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. There's another one completely completely done. These are all dry. I'm going to move these. Wow. We're getting a lot done. I'm excited because I was missing having these to play with. Okay, so there's that one. I think we can probably call these two done now. This one. Ooh, that's cool. Move that that way. That goes there. And then this is the 
little receipts and stuff. That's going to be fun to put into a pocket. Okie dokie. Where am I going to put this one? Let's see. Okay. Got it. Okay. I don't have much more, but we'll have some stuff to look at once I get done here. Um, let's try this. Let's put that face down and try and again pick some up off of the cardboard. That's my house cleaner that you're hearing bumping around. It's <laughs> probably moving the chairs and stuff. She's so awesome. I always, when when my kids were young and at home, I always wanted someone to help me, but couldn't afford it then. Now, now I just try and sell my journals so that I can pay her. <laughs> but it works out great because I'd rather be making a journal than cleaning my house. And <laughs> so she does that and I do the, let me do the journals. Okay, I'm going to put some on this one. And then, then I'm going to put one of these. Basically all the splattered papers. I think I printed them all because I thought, well, I'll just kind of see how that goes. I think my husband's going to the grocery. We have some special things to get when my my daughter and her family haven't been here forever, which I, I don't say to them because I don't want, ever want them to feel guilty, but at the same time, it's been forever. So there's certain like juices and foods and stuff that my daughter can um, eat. And there's a lot that she can't because that it's the daughter that's got the Crohn's disease. So so yeah, anyway, we try and stock up on things that she can eat. I mean, it's all stuff we can eat too once they go home, but... more beads. I kind of feel like I need a few around the edges. And on the other side. Yeah, so see how that does. Our, our um, house cleaner was saying that she really likes the Winco grocery store. We, we haven't gone there much. I mean, we're usually Costco for some of the bigger stuff. And... Um, where else do we? Oh, Walmart. Because our pharmacy is at Walmart, so that's why we go there. And and it's cheaper. But she was saying she felt Winco was very, very much cheaper. So we'll have to give that a try. what we think she's a skier and she was saying that this weekend because you know we got another well we got a storm that gave us about uh, eight inches of snow and then we had another one that was 
probably a foot, at least at my house it was a foot. And um, anyway, she was saying they went up to the ski hill and there was no places to park in the parking lot and it was literally packed full of people. She said the the road up to the ski hill was completely bumper to bumper traffic. So, so yeah, it was a little, it was real good snow, I think. Because they get more up there than we even do at our house. So I was happy for them. I think sometimes being a ski hill operator is kind of hit and miss a little bit. Okay. Gosh, guys, we almost have these all done. Hot, hot, hot. Oh, that one's pretty. Look at this one. Isn't that cool? Ooh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, and... All right, so what do I have left? I have like four pieces left. I think we might get them all done. Okay. I even used some of these in pa uh, as pages in journals, and I just try to put something on, you know, next to them that either, you know, is like, it's something that the if the wax melts a bit, it won't hurt it. But um, I also think, you know, you just have to know you've got beeswax papers in your journal and not leave it out in the sun or something. Oh, I want some smelly ones too. Yeah, I got all these smelly beads at the thrift store, so be on the lookout for these at your local thrift store. Okay, this one's going to be cool, I think. Look at that. Okay, and I'll do this one. I want to do the speckling of papers, the splattered papers again, too. That's going to be a mixed media Monday coming up because that was really fun. I really enjoyed that. I'm kind of hungry. Mike Mike brought down snacks for us. We always do that. He He usually comes down to the and works on the computer and stuff down here while she's cleaning and we get hungry because it takes her longer to clean the main floor than you know and then we uh, we don't have our normal lunch time you know old people get into a routine <laughs> which that was kind of fun about my son being here too is he definitely takes us out of our routine and that's a good thing because we do our days are pretty much the same other than you know if unless somebody comes to shake things up a little i've had a lot of stuff for the ywca board i'm like oh ready for that to slow down a little bit do you hear the carpenter he's sawing because he's fixing his goob, his goober. He had himself a little goober. Oh boy, hi. Sounds like they're coming right through. <laughs> I am so glad though that they're, they're gonna be able to do everything except the stairs. They have to wait for the ground to thaw so that they make sure that it's, you know, on their, in, um, you know, on a solid surface, I guess you would say. I'm glad that when I started this video, they were out shopping or whatever. 
Okay, most of what is printed is now covered, so. Wow, we got a lot done, you guys. I'm so excited. And scooch over a little bit. There. That works. Picking it up on the side. Sorry, you guys. That's really annoying. I, I don't know if it's annoying you. It's annoying me. <laughs> okay. But we are so getting there. There's that one. Isn't that? That one's really cool. Okay. And this one's good. Let's um, let's see what we can pick up with this one and just see if we can, that can be that and we'll be done. Yeah, it's gonna work, I think. These people infringing on my work time, aren't they? Work. <laughs> oh gosh, you guys, I swear I'm gonna have to be done. That's, I'm so sorry. Darn. Let's see if we can. Ugh. Yeah, they're just. I'm excited though because it's going to be really cool what he did. He just had the one post was just off a little bit. Okay, you guys, I am going to call that good, I think. Cuz those are those are pretty good. Okay, and then I can show you how we did. Oh, there's like this is rough because there's so much, there's so much. I think I need, I need to get some of that off of there. I've got some, um, let's, let's use this and see if we can get some of that off of there. Let's see. How to best do this, I don't know, but I'm gonna try and pull some of that wax. There's too much on the back of this one. We'll just add another layer to this jelly print, a little layer of... I don't even know what all those jelly prints are doing there. That's Maybe it was just from last time I jelly printed and I didn't put them away. I don't know. I need to organize my jelly prints a little bit because I, I keep them with um, unfinished, finished, and then ones to doodle on. And I think I need to, need to have myself a little. Maybe I pulled up enough of that. That's really cool. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to see if I can get a little more off my board. And then we're going to call it good. Ah! As I said, this cord is a problem. Oh, there's my laundry done. Sounds like it's time for me to go get some other stuff done, huh? Okay, let's call that. We're calling it. Ooh, that's cool. Okay, so don't put that on there. That will melt those. Okay. Let's pull this down. And let me turn off my iron. Okay, and we have we have some time. So I'm gonna show you some things. 
put the iron over there and try not to burn myself. Okay, this can go down there. Alrighty, let's look at let's look at the ones. Ooh, that's still really hot. That'll melt if I put anything down there. Um okay, so I showed you these two. Like, see, I've already cut some of that to use it in collage or something. This was just a uh paper I used to put under spray and stuff and and then I went ahead and did the did the fun wax. This is a digital that I waxed. Got some music paper here. That looks I think it looks really cool cuz the the back side kind of ends up coming through. That's kind of cool. Um these these I tried. These are um, scrapbook paper. N not a great result. Um, so I won't do that again. I mean, this one's kind of cool. The Tim Holtz one. And that's a Tim Holtz wallpaper. I just wanted to try different things. Those are like, eh. So here's another piece of the um, parchment paper that we did one today like that. And then this is an old ledger or something, 1956. And I love it. I, that, yeah, that's just fun. Here's some pieces of ephemera, which is why I wanted to do some more. Um, this is some paper that I got it on Amazon and I cr crinkled it up and then did it. It's, it's okay. Uh, what is this? This looks like, oh, it's an envelope. Kind of cool. And then I have a doily, too, that I did. I did just this part. And again, all of this stuff will likely be collage. I have used a few pages in journals. But, yeah, that's better. It's not as, as waxy on that side. But look at how fun that is. So that's one. Let's grab here. We're still warm there. So I'll just kind of show you, show you them all. And then, and then I'll let you get on with your day. That one has music behind the splatter. Ooh, this one feels real thick too. I might take some off of that. I'm gonna put that in a separate pile. That one, I'll do that afterward. This one's cool. Gosh, that feels awesome. And the envelopes. Look how many we got done, honestly. That's a ton. Antique book, some more of the the fun um, receipts. These. Another antique book. And then I'm going to put these over by my desk somewhere so that I have them right at hand. They've been living here on my mixed media table and I can't easily grab them. So that is what I'm going to do there. This one, why does it Oh, it's got two stuck together. Hello. So I need to get those apart. I was wondering why it felt so thick, but look at this. This is really cool. And then these two. This one. The thin papers really are cool with this. And then a jelly print. It's got a neat texture to it too. May use that a little bit. I wonder if I can get those get those apart. Wonder if my iron's hot enough still. Oh yeah, it's melting. I have two stuck together. <laughs> okay, let's see. Sheesh. There we go.
Ah, got him. <laughs> so there's another receipt. And then there's this one. And I'll have to find something to find something to kind of make that a little less. I'm putting my iron back on and I'll do that off the off the camera but I hope you enjoyed that I am super thrilled look at this big old thing of papers I have to play with yes so thanks for uh being here today thanks for watching I hope you have a grateful day and we'll just see you in the next video bye